Treća epizoda i smo sad u Srno gori. Ah. Dakle, nakon dva dana vožnje niz planina u Srno gori, moja mali italijanka i ja smo konačno stigle u Nikšić. I lepo smo sanjale. Da li možete da verujete da su došli ljudi iz Francuske, Italije, SAD, Velike Britanije, Polske i Kolumbije, Rusije, Ukrajine, Grčke, Holandije i Nemačke da uči vaš jezik? Iskreno ja mogu, jer sam jedan od ovih ludeka. Ovu letnu školu organizuje Matica Srpske, društvo članova u Srne Gori. Matica Srpske je najstariji i jedna od najznačajnije kulturne, prosvetne ustanove srpskog naroda. Nije dovoljno da Srbiju samo volite, već morate dobro poznavati srpsku istoriju, kulturu i jezik. I to smo uradili. 9 do 12, 5 dana u nedelji, učenje srpske diplomatike i govorne vežbe. We were given lectures by university lecturers. They're actually really, really well educated and they have a very good way of teaching you things. I popodne smo gledali srpske filmove. Svakoga dana u svakom pogledu sve više naprijed. Učili srpsku istoriju i čak smo pevali. I smo učili i folklor, koje sam lično se obožavala. Pozdrav iz prostorija javne ustanove Zahumlje. Naime, poleznici ljetne škole srpskog jezika upravo ovdje uče folklor. Upravo sada je jedan od takvih časova, pa ćemo mi da provjerimo i kako sve to izgleda. Idemo! Sa raznih strana svijeta, evo čak iz Vijetnam, iz Australije, iz Južne Amerike, nijesam vjerovao da tako imaju dobrog ritma i da tako mogu da usavrše svoje korake. Naše korake, ne svoje, nego naše korake i da vole da igraju folklor, to je folklor Balkane. I to mi je mnogo drago i evo, nadam se da će biti i u narednim godinama ljudi koji će doći ovdje da nauče folklor. Naučili smo da pišemo karigrafiju, čirilice i glagolice. The professor told us that every single line of every letter has a meaning. It's all linked to God and divinity and, and it just shows how like smart Serbs were when they were actually coming up with letters. Evo za početak jednog Miroslova na glagoljicu. Nećemo tražiti od vas da učite glagoljicu, ali poslije možemo da ispišemo svako ome ime ili u toku dok se budemo družili da ima kod sebe kako bi izgledala glagoljica. I dok smo na stvorenje alfabeta srpskog jezika, da li ste znali da je Vuk Karičić uzeo istočno hrcegovački dijalekt koji se govore u Nikšiću kao standardni dijalekt za čitav srpski jezik? I zato naša škola se nalazi u srcu Nikšića. I ne samo to. Grad se nalazi na savršenoj lokaciji između planina i mora. Tako su naše ekskurzije izgledaju ovako. Ceo dan na brodu, uživali smo Tiftu i Kotoru, bili smo na nekim drugim ostrovima. Evo me je mejd. Jer smo se uvijekali mnogo i to je samo da se uvijekali i da se uvijekali i da se uvijekali. I smo svi uvijekali u vodu. I sam sviđa da je uvijekali to. Uvijekali sam uvijekali to. Uvijekali sam uvijekali to. We also visited many monasteries in Montenegro. The monastery of St. Basil, uh, Sveti Ostrog, Vasilije Ostrogski. That monastery was just absolutely beautiful. I loved it. Um, I think I'm a, quite a religious person, so it really touched me. I am a religion teacher in Vienna for the Orthodox students and many of them come from Serbia. I want to approach, approach the <laughs> children and to know better their cultural and uh, their language. <laughs> my, my accent is so Greek, but okay. Uh, I was really impressed from the tradition of monasteries and from their hospitality. We met also the bishop. Bishop. <laughs> I really enjoyed the trip to Ostro. 
mainly the part after that when we went to the river and just could swim in the river and it was so beautiful and I feel like that's also some tipping points within the group. <laughs> Like from that moment on, we had a lot, lot more fun as a group. And then everyone just decided to start dancing and I don't know, I had a lot of fun. It was it was so great. Montenegro has a beautiful nature. I enjoyed the rafting in in the river Tara. How is it? Clear but very cold river. It was really funny. <laughs> the excursion to Zapyak, if I pronounce it. <laughs> Zapjak. Oh, it was so beautiful. We saw the mountain range Dormitor and I actually injured my foot during this trip. This is me in sport. I actually managed to get to the top to Sabin Kok, which was <laughs> the mountain peak. It was like over 2,000 meters, I think. And Did you break your stick? <laughs> no. A little bit. It, was, it just felt really rewarding because the view was amazing and I think if I didn't go up there I would have I would have missed such an amazing view so I'm proud of myself for that. <laughs> Personally I've never been on a mountain before that high and it, I had to actually stand for a moment and take it all in. It was really cool. Like the Black Lake, well I said it multiple times but I cannot describe by words how beautiful that was. It was incredibly. I am very thankful for the new things that I have learned here in Montenegro. I have a lot of older, a lot of older people, all of them are different countries. It turned out that you have a lot in common with most people. I think everyone is like very unique, everyone is special in their own way. And you can have fun with people even though you don't have a common language. <laughs> it's just so wild to me that people want to learn Serbian but aren't Serbian. We had a lot of fun together, a lot of fun nights, fun days. I'm gonna be cheesy here and I'm gonna be saying the bonds that we made because seriously that is, I will definitely take that away from summer school. Yeah, I think it was like one of the easiest decisions I actually ever made. That was one of the most beautiful experiences that someone can ever can, can ever have. I suggest it for everyone. Bilo da ste srpska diaspora. Pričaj srpski da te cijeli svijet razumije. Ili stranac. Pričaj srpski. Da te sjeli, svijet razumije. <laughs> Početni. Tičaj srpski, da te sjeli, svijet razumije. Ili napredan. Do I have to do the cijeli svijet? Moraš pjekavica. Oh my god. Wait, I forgot it. <laughs> Pričaj srpski, da te sjeli, svijet razumije. Na ovoj letnjoj školi zaista verujem da ćete napuniti vaše želje ne samo o srpskom jeziku, ali sve o ostalim elementima srpske kulture. Upoznat ćete ljudi iz celog sveta, kao i domaće srnogorce. I imat će jedno od najboljih, nezaboravnih leta u svom životu. Kao i ja.